What is up, YouTube? We here. Yes, yeah, sir. Let me get Rise of Red Sea in the comments if you support. Or if you're just watching, you don't support the Cardinals. Give me what's up. How you doing? What's up? We here. We here. We here. Episode 2 of the Cardinals theme team. And we got oh, a couple of little changes before we got into the video. Get into the gameplay. No. As you know, I do be playing weekend league every weekend. A couple games in the videos. If it's just one interesting game, I'll try to include the one game. But, you know. On offense, you see, same thing. Now, this is recording on Saturday. The playoffs promo did just come out, and we do have something for you. Tyran Matthew fully upgraded. I'm going to change the Carter actually right now with you guys because I do have it on this Carter. But, you know, we do have the Tyran Matthew. We do have the card, as you see. Now, we do have him at free safety. I would have him at strong safety, but. You know, you can't change Isaiah Simmons without the power up. Isaiah Simmons strong safety, him at free safety. He's I know the overall is better. I mean worse. But if we check real quick, Isaiah Simmons is a ninety seven uh, strong safety. And if you do have Tyran Matthew as strong safety, he doesn't show it here, but he is actually a ninety eight overall. And he is better than better than Buda Baker. The overall will not show it here. But if I did have him as strong safety, he would be a 98 overall. And with that, I'm going to show you real quick. We do have our first 99 on the team. You can't see it here. 99 the bomb. I can't really tell, honestly. My screen's being a little... But he is a 99. Let me just double check. I might be completely wrong. Yeah, 99. You see it right there. 99 Isaiah Simmons. I mean, Isaiah Simmons. Tyran Matthew, my bad. 99 Tyran Matthew. First 99 on the team. Now with him, I do have him a stud linebacker because of his height. Now I would, that's also another reason to have Isaiah Simmons strong, strong safety. When you have a deep, I don't want someone short out there. He's going to get caught over. Isaiah Simmons is tall. Isaiah Simmons is fast. Isaiah Simmons will get to the ball over top. But perfect. It's a little guy down this little middle linebacker. Zoom across. Great user. And with how my defense runs when I run the 4-6 formation with the cover 2. He will be deep. I will be using him. And something he does get is Lurker. I have Lurker on him. So my first Lurker player on my team. We'll have him up deep, man. And uh, he'll be doing some stuff for us down there. Now we got the same team around here. Isaiah Simmons will be on the field all times. Tyron Matthews will be on the field all times. And passing. When I'm on passing downs, like third and ten, I know he's going to pass it. That is when I'll have Buda Baker on the field. But I can't wait for the Hassan Reddick upgrade to get rid of the Von Kennard. We did get the Dwight Freeney power up 95 down here. And John Brown, I will have him by the next video. The reason I'm not in a rush is because he does not get those get those uh, Cardinals chems. No power up for John Brown. But he will be here for the next video. I can tell you that much. But for now, we got the defensive upgrades that's already powerful enough. Defensive upgrades, Tyran Matthew. You got the Dwight Freeney power up to get his overall up. I'm going to show you two weekend league games, and who knows, if I do get the John Brown and I play a game on Sunday, it's Saturday right now, I will tell you guys, obviously, before the game if I do have him. But for now, this is the team. Let's get into our weekend league games. You know, Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like. Subscribe if you're interested. Subscribe if you like my content. Leave some feedback in the comments, you know, how I'm doing. Tell me what's up. But yeah, let's get into the games. Let's not make this intro even longer than it already is. All right, I'll see you guys. Peace out. Here we go. We got a Falcons theme team in our game. And this is going to be our only game of the video. I did change my mind. This this game was one of the best games I've played all year. Easily the most entertaining game. Easily the craziest game i played all year. Most highlight plays. Here we go. Falcons theme team. Brett Favre at the quarterback. First play. Making all his audibles, man. Play action. I fall for it. I recover. Bombs are deep and over the top. First play, touchdown on me. I fell for the play action, dude. First play, touchdown. It's 7-0 after one play. And that's just a first play on offense from the first play of scrimmage. Now here we go. This is my first play. I get right through that, through that hole, right in the hole, man. <laughs> we get the quick game. Second and three. He's pressing his guys. He's got one safety over top. I run it. Break the tackle in the big hole. Almost. Almost. Almost all the gone. All the way gone. Kenyon Drake does plow through there. Now here we do have a play action. When I see people call man coverage, I love this route. Tight end drag. And he gets so more so much more trucks to tackle. 
Almost shrugs another one, gets to the 10. That's a 38 yard pass on the quick underneath the tight end. Whenever they call, man coverage, I love that route. Now, here I like what I see. I do change it to a run play. Pull it outside through the needle, thread that needle like it's. Like we're sewing, like we're sewing something, man. Thread that needle. Now, here. He gets the ball back. His first play. I did call the wrong play on defense. Wasn't really paying attention. Probably my fault. And Julio Jones just takes full advantage of it. Wrong play. And he gains. Thir two catches, 120 yards. He gains plenty of yards on that. I meant to say, yes, two catches, 120 yards to Julio Jones. Both of his passes. Now here he runs the ball. First time he runs the ball all game, and he's going to learn his lesson. Double hit stick. Double hit stick. Gets smashed. Second and three. And calling this audibles, calling this audibles. Play action. I know it's play action. I see an in route coming across. Cover Tyran and over top. I did not even see Devin Hester go across. That's his touchdown. Devin Hester. You know, that air raid offense is getting me, dude. But Kenyon Drake here. Nice little game. But that air raid offense, that was a problem. I was worried. I was about to quit soon if he kept doing that to me. Here, third and one. Get the conversion by a yard to Kenyon Drake. I just need a conversion. I didn't need yards that play. Here, I know he's calling man coverage, but I got Todd Heap again. A quick first down. I wanted to get to Hopkins that play, but he was covered tight. God, Todd Heap always works. Now, here, read options. I know the man coverage gets around. Oh my god, we got one man to beat. Ed Reed, gone, 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 gone. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Swerve, Kyler Murray all the way to the house. Now here, tight, tight throw. Lots of tight throws, lots of tight catches. Smart, perfect timing by him. He did have that air raid offense on me. Here, out route and incomplete. He tries it there. He tries it. We got covered. I'm starting to adapt on defense. We're starting to adapt. Tyron Matthew on the user there. He sees someone going deep. Bombs it. Knocked down by Simmons and picked off by Night Train Lane. Now let me go, let me go. Broke a tackle, broke the tackle, okay, okay, okay. And down the sideline, just misses Brett Favre. Touchdown, Todd Gurley is not going to catch him. Night Train Lane, I think, is the best interception returner in this defense. I feel like he always breaks a tackle from the wide receiver. Gets all the way, now he sees someone deep. Oh man, Isaiah Simmons. If that was thrown any deeper, that was a big play. But Isaiah Simmons picks it off and gone again. Again, this time Todd Gurley pulls a DK Metcalf, does not want another pick six. Now it's 21 to 14, I have the ball here. I fit it to Kenyon Drake, and this was crazy. Picks it up off Kenyon Drake's foot for an interception after Kenyon Drake gets hit. Gets the ball back, I'm like, oh man, oh man. Play action here, and he gets a tight Calvin Ridley throw. 37 seconds left to half, I don't think he realized the time here, 15 seconds left in the half. I think it's when he just starts realizing how much time is left in the half. He runs the ball though, and fumbles. Either way, he fumbles. I don't think he actually never mind. I don't think he realized at all what time it was in half. I don't think he's paying attention to the clock. Now, right away, I go for a 54-yard field goal. Zane Gonzalez does some things. All things misses it. Does not have the power. It's a gold kicker, man. Zane Gonzalez misses the field goal, so I can't go up by two scores. Only up by one. First play back. Kenyon Drake with a nice, nice run. Now here we got the press coverage and the man, I always see this. You know, Todd Heap always beats that man coverage. You can't have a man coverage on Todd Heap on that route. That's what you, that's what I do every time someone calls that cover two man on me. And here I see, I, I'm going to try to press coverage. I see the corner blitzes. I throw it and man, I threw that way too late. And he does some crazy stuff I've never seen. He does a little stop and completely freezes Kyler Murray. Pick six. Gets one back on me. I got one of him before. 21-21 now. I saw the press coverage. Couldn't throw it there. And I just tried to make a dumb throw quick. Not work. That's Todd Heap. Nice catch. Here we go. Deep route. I try. See, I like. I tried the press coverage. I see you. Desmond Trufant covering John Hopkins. I know he would not cover him in real life. But in the game, man, that's different. Team, team, boosts him up. Devin Trufant locks down Hopkins in the deep route. Tried it. Did not work. But he gets the ball and we get a sack. So now it's 21-21. He gets the ball back in the interception. And he has the X factor. Now, oh my god. I did have it usered. But he did a smart thing. You know. Led his receiver away from my user. Smart thing. I'll give it to him. He runs it. That's a quick stop by Campbell. That's with a 3D lineman. Campbell with the ability of the middle. Always usually works. I love that. Now here, oh my god, right over the user and somehow catches it in traffic. 
Devin Hester, man, getting those t catches, getting those catches in contact. I don't know if he did that that much in real life, but here, diving catch of Devin Hester, his wide receiver, his number one. Julio Jones, the first couple plays, but Devin Hester's been killing me. The speed, now a screen, I read it perfectly. Bring him down, bring him down, five yard loss. Third and 15 here. Down by, down, not down at all, he's tied, my bad. Gets the tall girly, takes his field goal. A minute 48 left in the game. I don't know if you watch the clock, it's not a minute 48 left in the game. We need a game winning drive here. Kickoff, man, I'm gonna get a on trail roll, on trail roll here. I see a hole, and that's it. There's nothing much to say. Ryan Poole, not gonna make a tackle on me. I go all the way, I get happy. I jump, man. Kick return touchdown to put me up. With a minute 48 left in the game, on trail roll. It's been a little shaky on those kick returns. He had a couple good returns this game to the 30, but that one wasn't really mattered. Now here on offense, he has no one open. I know who he's throwing to, and oh my god, drop the interception to win the game. Third, six, minute 21 left for him. He has all three timeouts. It's third and six, tight, you know, important play here. He's going to have to make a good decision. And he gets it underneath, and Todd Gurley runs all the way. I had my guys back. Gets out of bounds, too. Does not waste his timeout. Now here, he's got first and ten. Runs it inside, down by four. And Aeneas Williams makes him pay for done, calling a dumb play like that. I don't know why you'd run it. And here, Tyron Matthew. First interception on the team is a game sealer. I take, I go down here. No, I just want to show this quick. Running out the clock, I just, you know, had to. I had to with Kyler Murray. And I did not slide. I could have literally lost the game on that. But game over. That's it. Crazy game, man. I won it on a kick return touchdown. Entro Roll has literally bobbled the kick returns a couple times. Bobbled punt returns. He's fumbled on a punt return once. He muffed it. And the other team got it. But, you know, I trust him. I trust him. He's my kick returner. Because I don't really use him that much. I don't use him. He's my kick returner. I'm going to go through a stats here real quick. I'm not going to say much, but I just wanted to show you guys. I'm going to keep talking, though. But that's it for the video. If you enjoy, subscribe. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Leave me some feedback in the comments, man. And don't forget to check the next video. I usually upload sometime Sunday or Monday. This video is on a Sunday. But hope you guys have a good weekend. Hope you guys have a good week. I'll see you in the next one. And, yeah, peace out.